Hello there, Divi Nation. It's Andrew Palmer from Elegant Marketplace bringing you Jason Dunnell, who is a developer. In fact, the first developer that we've had on Elegant Marketplace that developed the first plugin stroke module uh, called Tilted Image, uh, which was Visual Builder compatible. We then had a chat with him, and he's put together a lovely little course which will help you develop your own modules using the Divi API, and of course, a bit of React, some JavaScript, and PHP. So over to you, Jason, and introduce yourself. Tell us who you are. Hey, um, sure. Uh, I'm Jason Durnell. I'm a psychotherapist as well. I uh, live in Eastern Virginia. I, I cater mostly to, to healthcare, and I'm, I write healthcare applications, and I came across uh, Divi when I needed a website, and I never turned back. Excellent. And then what made you decide to build modules? Well, I started off, before I was a psychotherapist, I started off as a uh, software developer in different, in the shipping industry and writing software for election systems and, and such. And, um, wow. and uh, then I got into psychotherapy, and I kind of, tried to combine the, the two, and um, when I, once I got into Divi, uh, being a programmer, I had to look under the hood, and, of course. <laughs> yeah. and uh, I, I wanted to see how the modules were developed, and I've been very interested in it for a while. Uh, there's a pretty good community out there uh, for the people that build Divi plugins. For sure. Uh, some Facebook groups, and I've learned quite a bit, and um, I have, I know a lot to a, to a lot of others before me. Excellent. So you can bring your knowledge into the Divi community, help us all understand how a module is built using the React system, using all the kind of coding that we're all used to hearing, like PHP, JavaScript, and, and CSS, and that has um, helped you build that tilted image module as well. You've got another one, which is a grid layout as well, which is, again, visual builder friendly. So let's move on to uh, what the course can offer a newbie like me, say I'm a non-coder, uh, sure. is it aimed at myself or is it aimed at a more experienced coding person? Well, um, I go through each code, I go through the code line by line. And so if you're a non-coder, I think you'll still be able to understand what I'm going through. It is helpful if you do know some PHP or JavaScript or React, but uh, I try to start from building blocks. Um, from the ground up and and we go through it and i actually take you through the whole process of me creating that image grid module excellent um we start from 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 a blank screen to a full module and uh i, I take you by that step by step uh we go through uh react primer in the course um which a lot of developers who are not familiar with react uh, may like, and I think WordPress in general, uh, having this React knowledge um, with the new Gutenberg uh, advancements in WordPress, uh, will React will be a va very valuable tool. I think so, yeah. I was in Serbia a couple of weeks ago. I mean, today is Sunday, the 8th of July. And so a couple of weeks ago, I was in, in Serbia for WordCamp. I saw Matt Munweg's uh, keynote speech. Oh, wow. You went to WordCamp in Serbia. That's I awesome. did, indeed. It was, it's the second largest uh, WordCamp in the world. It's the, it's the European WordCamp. So okay. there, were, there were about 3,500 people there. It was quite educational for me. It made us realize or certainly made me re-realize re that you know, the Divi community is a very, very small part of WordPress. Uh, it is. You know, yeah. it's, a, it's a little tiny blip on the landscape, if you like. Uh, but it's growing. And, and I met the uh, Elemental guys out there. I met some other mm -hmm. page builder guys out there. And we were all talking about, obviously, Gutenberg was the, the biggest talking point. Mm -hmm. um, and it's coming out supposedly at the end of August, according to Matt's um, uh, keynote speech there. Mm -hmm. He was quite vague on, on um, delivery times. It's his okay. It's his baby. He's the project leader on it. Okay. Um, but the one thing that he did say to developers last year as well in, in all his keynote speeches was learn JavaScript. Absolutely. And, you know, he said to people, put, put your hands up. 
Um, you got to think this auditorium was absolutely packed. It was the biggest auditorium there. So there are at least a couple of thousand people in there listening mm -hmm. to him. And literally only a handful of people put up their hands to say, yeah, we're learning JavaScript. And he said, well, wow. let, me, okay. let me tell you guys, learn JavaScript. <laughs> you know, it's uh, it's going to be an essential because you're going to have to make your plugins work with Gutenberg. You're going to have to make your plugins work with React. And you're just yeah. going to have to have to really up your programming game. So that's why I'm very pleased that you've got this course in because it does it dives... I think it dives pretty deeply into um, how to make... Uh, a module for Divi, but not only that, but why you would need to make it this way. So it's visual, visual builder compatible. Right. It kind of helps the developers that certainly that we're um, featuring on Elegant Marketplace. You know, we've got 120 vendors on there now. So I think you've got about 119 customers excluding you. So, you know, we, we've priced it accordingly. So even developers will invest in this course as well. Uh, mm -hmm. And the benefit to them would be that sales will go up. There's no doubt about it because if it's React or if it's uh, Visual Builder Composer, sorry, Visual Builder compatible, then we're going to get rid of that annoying little message that says this plugin is not Divi Builder compatible. Okay. It, when people do get that message, it's a, it's an actual misnomer. It, it is Divi Builder compatible. It's just not. Sure. It's just not. Visual, builder, yeah. It's just not Visual Builder compatible. So, um, let's just share screens a second. We'll go, we'll go through your um, Divi module development seats so to to show what's on there just very very quickly. So bear with me a second while I share my screen. Okay. And here it is. And there's the price. It's it's starting off at 125, but we've reduced it to 6250 so that we can get as many people to join. It's going to be up that. Uh, so on launch it will be at that price for seven days only so everybody who's watching this get in now because uh, that price is not uh, there forever it's just going to be there for a week um, and it tells you about the development environment um, you've got two sections on that what's going on, on the PHP side your CSS grid field visibility now that's very important because in the visual builder it uh, renders the fields slightly differently, doesn't it, Jason? So, yeah. you know, we've got to make sure that we've got uh, the visibility of our fields. And it's going to, it just goes through React uh, as well. That's quite a short course, to be honest, for something that this is, that is going um, this in depth. But what I like about it is that there are um, some uh, real good show notes with there as well. And there's lots of uh, information. Let me just uh, view as uh, myself so that I can get into that information. Okay. And I can go in and say, okay, well, let's have a look at the PHP side. I've jumped, I've jumped a bit there, but it gives you nice um, links to the code that you're going to need. Mm -hmm. um, and it, you know, there's some, there's some great show notes, as I say, it's most important when um, there's a course that we have actually, the links going into, um, you know, where the students are going to go and get their own information. Absolutely. Um, and I'm sure that down the line, we're going to be developing a, a little webinar hosted by myself and you, just mm -hmm. to, if people have got any extra um, issues around that. And yeah. we're also, you know, if necessary, we're going to set up a little face, a private Facebook group. Yeah, so I'd like to have a private Facebook group for the uh, users of the course. So uh, exactly. I will be supporting the course. Exactly. So, and that's that's the way we do it. And obviously, if anyone's got any questions, they can ask them via us or they can ask uh, via the, the, the form here on uh, elegantmarketplace.net. But as I say, it's a very uh, intensive course. It's, uh, I'm going to stop sharing now. Okay. It's a very intensive course. And I think you've done well in producing it and putting it together Thank you. and aiming for the, the right kind of audience, if you like, because everybody likes to feel that they're a developer if they're using Divi. We like to be able sure. to know that we can expand upon what Divi can actually offer us. Yes. It, you know, from its core, Divi is unbelievably fantastic. But you know, when you want to do those little tweaks or when you want a module to do a certain thing, I think what you've produced here will be able to you know, help all of us it's a facilitator, if you like, to helping us understand how Divi works, which is great. Mm -hmm. So we can even expand upon our own ideas. We don't necessarily have to revert back to the course. We can say, right, well, I've got that yeah. knowledge. I know, yeah. I know exactly that how That was my aim, yeah. to be able to give you the knowledge to expand upon your own creative ideas. Indeed. Um, 
let me just have a quick drink because it's nice and hot in this country. It's uh, oh yes, so it's uh, thirty degrees at the moment, so it's killing, wow. killing a person with me like fair hair. I'm dying here, but no <laughs> one. But uh, your part of the world, what sort of temperature are we talking? Is it nice and hot, nice and warm? It's been uh, pretty, pretty hot. Um, today we got a little bit of a break because we had a nice rain last night. But uh, yeah, surprising how much rain can just t- kind of take that level off, take, take that, the edge off of it just yeah, a little exactly, bit. Exactly, exactly. So on that, on the, on um, just talking about the weather, but <laughs> which is sure. a, very, a very British thing to do. Actually, you weren't talking about, <laughs> but. Um, you mentioned psychology, so I want to dive yeah. dive deeper into that and maybe talk of you know give it two minutes or something because I know that psychology is a, a very important subject and people don't really you know there's there's mental health to me is a very important um, situation yeah. making sure that we're all working to our best capability we're all dealing with our family issues if we've got any to the best of our ability as well so not only are you you've done this this uh, course here. Yes, I've also had a conversation with you about trying to develop a well-being course for um, not just Divi users, but for for web developers and for creatives and for designers of yes. how to actually make sure that you stay sane because you're staying in front of a, a computer screen for so long and you're dealing yes. with difficult customers and you're dealing with you know family situations or wearing you know, how long are you going to stay in front of that computer for uh-huh. god's sakes you know and all this kind of stuff so one of the things that i want to want to um sort of just put out there is that you and i are putting our heads together and trying to mm-hmm. formulate a psychology course on that so that i think that's quite exciting I, I would love to do that the community doesn't have anything of that sort absolutely not no and i think as, as you and i think it could be really helpful especially with everything that's going on today well, let's hope that this course can can fly and help you finance that because we know that it's difficult putting together courses. I've put a few. It is, it is but it's a few enjoyable. together. Yeah, no, it's an invest. It's a, it's a massive investment in time, and for that, I appreciate that, Jason. So, Absolutely. what I'd like to say now is basically thank you for joining me. Hopefully, you know the community will have seen you and enjoyed your introduction and know who the course uh, tutor is because I think that's all and that's very important. Yes. Um, you've got just a. Uh, a 10 line or a 20 second goodbye on this this interview of why you why you felt you had to build this course and what the benefits are going to be to the to the yeah. well i there's the the documentation that's been put out by elegant themes is is good but by no means complete and i wanted to take people through that. I go through some of the documentation. We go well beyond uh, what's in the documentation on the course. And, uh, and I had to go through many trials and errors myself. Uh, There's a lot of guesswork. And I thought after I learned all that, it would be good to put a course together uh, so people don't have to do that themselves and spend all that time themselves. Uh, I've already done it. So, let me teach you what I've learned. Fantastic. All right, then. Thank you, sir. And I appreciate your time today. And uh, sorry, I was a little bit tardy myself as well. It's all right. um, we'll get there. We'll be launching this course within the next, uh, from today, within the next uh, 48 hours at the latest, probably within 24 hours. So I look forward to seeing how the sales go. And I'll speak to you very, very soon. All right, Andrew. Good to speak to you. Thank you, sir. Okay.